Little sign, remember. I can't wake him. I know. Uh. And now, fresh piece of toast. Uh. And in one jump cut, it's gonna be gone. Oh, and would you look like that? Clockwork. And now to perform my famous technique of getting up the stairs without using my arms or my legs. How does that even work? Look, this is Sonic. I don't know, nor do I care. So, Jeffy sleepwalks. Well, this ought to be interesting at least. Right? This video begins with Mario telling Jeffy it's bedtime and that he needs to put his pajamas on. Jeffy says he doesn't want to and says he wants to sleep in his big boy pants. Mario says he would let Jeffy do that, but every time he does, he ends up pooping himself. Jeffy does the obvious joke and Mario just tells Jeffy he has to sleep in it. Jeffy then wants to play his cat piano and Mario throws the cat piano away from him. Jeffy then says he wants cereal and then Jeffy makes this weird yelling noise, which is admittedly rather amusing. <laughs> Mario then goes to turn off the lights, and there's a run-on joke of Jeffy screaming every time the lights go off, which isn't very funny in my opinion. This wouldn't be so bad if it didn't go on for an entire minute! Then we cut to more bickering between Mario and Jeffy, including Mario making the mistake of saying the boogeyman doesn't like kids who poop their pants, and so Jeffy makes the obvious unfunny joke. And then Jeffy begins playing his cat piano again. This part is funny, including the part where Mario throws the cat piano out the window, and Mario has to tell Jeffy he ate the cat piano. Jeffy is wondering why Mario would do this, and eventually Mario tells Jeffy to go to sleep, or he'll staple his eyelids shut. And then... Jeffy keeps talking. Eventually, Mario yells at Jeffy, and Jeffy does that weird yelling thing from earlier. And finally, four minutes into the video, we get to the actual plot of the episode. Jeffy turns out to be sleepwalking because he goes out of the room, into the kitchen, breaks a bowl, and pours himself some Fruit Loops and milk. Jeffy goes to bed with a single spoon of cereal and nothing else, and he goes back to sleep. The video cuts to the next morning, where Mario hopes Jeffy is dead, but he isn't, which gets Mario upset. Mario goes to make breakfast and runs across the mess Jeffy made of the Fruit Loops and milk, and Mario figures out fairly quickly who did this. Jeffy doesn't remember any of this, and Mario finds a trail of Fruit Loops leading to the bedroom and Jeffy's crib. Now, minor nitpick, but how did the Fruit Loops get there on the ground? I can guarantee that Jeffy didn't have that many on a spoon to begin with, let alone drop that many. Whatever. It's a nitpick anyways. Mario gets angry with Jeffy for making a mess, and Jeffy seems confused as ever. Mario decides to try and catch Jeffy in the act by setting up a camera. It cuts to that night, and Jeffy continues insisting that he didn't make the mess. And then we cut to the next morning, where we see the living room completely torn apart. Mario shows Jeffy the mess, and when Jeffy denies everything still, Mario shows Jeffy the camera footage. Mario then grounds Jeffy, and Jeffy gets upset by this. Therefore, Mario decides to just have Jeffy clean up the entire living room with him. That night, Mario is still upset with Jeffy. Jeffy says he didn't see himself do it, and then Jeffy goes to sleep. However, Mario is still awake, presumably due to Jeffy's snoring. Yeah, we'll call it that. Jeffy then climbs out of his crib, and Mario sees this and follows. Mario then realizes that Jeffy was sleepwalking, and Mario decides to wake him up, despite the fact you aren't supposed to. Jeffy then explains how he wasn't actually sleeping, and that he was just trying to see what he could do with his eyes closed. Wow. And that's how the video ends. So, in the end, eh, this video wasn't very funny, and the ending was just mediocre. And so is the plot, and, well, everything, really. While there were a couple funny jokes, it was immediately negated by all the not funny jokes. The plot was okay enough, but the ending kinda sorta ruined it, and speaking of which, the ending was just dumb. So in the end, while not awful, I don't think many people will remember this for anything besides being a mediocre video, hence why I'm giving this video a 3.5 out of 5, or color yellow range rating for being just mediocre. Well, thank you all for watching, and take care. Just follow my moves and sneak around. Be careful not to make a sound.